Yeah, um, that never ended up happening, and I suppose what we got out of that, the best we got out of that was forward into dawn, which, yeah. if you're, if we're really honest, that, that 343 production wasn't that bad, because it, it at least took place outside of a couple intro scenes, which you can ignore, um, it, it really is just an old story from the beginning of the, from the beginning of the war, so it works, and, like, uh, when you, when they find the secret footage of, like, a cult, of, like, uh, one of those, Master Chief's recording, and you get that epic shot of, uh, 104 Frederick. Yep. For, oh, goddamn Fred. I love Fred. Fred is my favorite Oh, no! Oh. Okay, my favorite... My favorite Spartan 2 was only in one of the books. He never appeared in any of the games, um, and that would have been Kurt 051. Right. Which book was he from? Uh, Ghost of Onyx. He was yes. the one they... He was the only one of the three Spartans that was genuinely missing. And they, he was abducted by Ackerson to, uh, train Spartan 3s. Yeah. I... Oh! I could've I, just I done feel, that I feel like I'm out of my element, because, like, compared to you guys, I'm an idiot child when it comes to the lore of Halo. Broke. All of the- all of Noble Team died on Reach. Woke. June went on to train most of the fucking Spartan 4s. I love June. June's great. Ugh. I wish Emil would have survived. Yeah, oh, yeah I remember June and No, Emil. actually, um... You know, actually, they had to, that was a retcon, because a, Bungie gave an original explanation, but 343 just altered it. Uh, do you want to know what- do you want to know what Bungie's original explanation was? What was what? it? Okay, well, you see, uh... Oh, no! The uh. Reach novelization was still canon to a point. Yeah. Um, so what actually happened was you're like, okay, well, wait a minute, how come... How come he doesn't reappear in Ghost of Onyx or uh, First Strike or anything? Shit! And allegedly the reason is that um, Jun, uh, Jun and Halsey were uh, found themselves essentially in a sticky situation, and Jun d pulled essentially pulled a, uh, a run to safety while I hold them off kind of moment, and then he was never seen again. And uh, so something about yeah, he's listed as missing, but I think Halsey it was mentioned that Halsey knew he was dead or something. I love June. June and Emil were my two favorite uh, Spartans from Noble Team. Wasn't June yeah. the one that was sniped in the head? No, that was a uh, cat. Oh. Okay. Yeah, and I... the ex the explanation for that was that she doesn't like having her shields on while she works, and while running through the building, merely forgot to turn them on. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh... that fucking blows. That's a uh, that's a bit of an explanation for me. That but... explains why she got done in by a needle or through the head. Yeah. Yeah. No, because. The shields would have otherwise blocked it, and you notice her shields never ping either. Yeah. Because she, because apparently we're working with electronics, she prefers to have them turned off. So I the just... shields don't like short out what she's working on. I think part of it, and they also mentioned something about her getting slightly annoyed with the interference that they can cause while working on stuff. So. Hmm. I just love that Emil was able to take a energy sword through the back and just keep fighting. Like he, he had enough strength to turn around and stab the elite in the throat. That's so weird. Literally too <laughs> angry to die. Literally too angry to die. <laughs> I yeah, and then you later find out he killed both he killed both of them and they were honor guards on top of that. And he just apparent after killing both of them just took a seat next to the uh mat gun. Uh, next to the mat gun and then just died <laughs> like casually sitting down. Yeah. That, like, Emil was badass. Oh, no, 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 no. Go, 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 yeah. go. Oh, my Stand God. My boy. No! What are we even Actually, talking about? They're, they're talking, about talking about Halo. Halo. No, dude, uh, one of the best, one of the best missions, though, <gasps> Long Night of Solace. You get to an epic beachhead charge into so a space station, and then everywhere. you get into a fucking saber. I love You have a sabers. space battle. You have a space battle and a fucking saber. You, so you defend a space station. <laughs> And then you get to launch an attack with all the radio, the epic radio communication on a Covenant Corvette with the fucking Savannah backing you up. Even though, even though Savannah is destroyed later, it's still pretty awesome to be yeah. flying around as two like warships are fighting each other, and you, and yeah. It's like, it was also it the, yeah. Also, now I think about it, I want to ask: Do you guys like? In your opinions, which Noble Team member had the most badass death? Noble Six. Noble yeah. Six. Yeah, Noble Six. You know what, fast. 
cannot contribute to this conversation. <laughs> yeah, no, dude, I can't. You get to see. You can last as long as you want, and you actually and and it's strangely emotional in a way that makes most players strangely emotional. Your fucking armor starts falling apart. Yep. Yeah, like your visor starts cracking. You lose some of your HUD. It was yeah, like and then the, you. How, like for me, it was like the uh, the moment where I like read from the lore of uh, Warhammer 40k, the guard of Kadia, the Kadia broke before the guard did. And that, yeah, no. that just fucks me up every time. Yeah, no, no, no. Like, and even if you count the uh, the ending cutscene where he finally does die, um, he was charged by seven honor guards and kills four of kills four of them and severely injures a, a fifth before they finally end up killing him. Yeah, that moment like... where you need three elites to hold you down so that one can knuckle blade you in the neck. <laughs> after you've they... after you've already killed for, after you've already killed more than half of their squad of friends. Yeah. Like, like I, I, I he would have he would have kept going until the planet was fucking glass if they wouldn't have held him down. Yep. Fuck yeah. Like I, I mean I like. That sort of I'm just gonna... fucking. I will take as many yeah, as I can. I'm just gonna take all these and. In... I'm, yeah. I'm gonna go out. Bless you. So, man, no. Like, Bless you. Do you know how? Bless. If it makes it feel any better, I'm on the um. I'm on the live feature. Um. Oh, that works. Yeah. No, like uh, a thing I was yeah. infamous for. I was kind of infamous for this also in Modern Warfare 2 and beyond because of Semtex grenades, but I was infamous for getting a fuckload of kill beyond the graves, to the point where um, oh. some people some people who came at me with energy swords actually sometimes hated coming at me because I either, it was either I kill them, or even if they were to kill me, I'm, I was like way too good at sticking them at the last second. The fucking kill there. after deaths in Modern Warfare were a bitch to deal with. I always no, I always grenades. stuck people. Oh, I always like... stuck people. You were one you of them fucks. I a lot of people off. Off. <laughs> no, no, not just that. I, not just that. Yeah, no, a kill from beyond the grave, and you have a like a like an uwu ghost face, but like <laughs> kind of. Oh my god. Um, so I got stuck. Kill from beyond the grave. You throw up the Takeshi um. six nine gang sign. No, no, but something, something even worse. Uh, I was also into Halo parkour, and I would use it during matchmaking a lot. Halo yeah, parkour sounds amazing. I never experienced it, but it sounds amazing. <laughs> I just, I... I just saw that meme tastic uh, <sighs> counter the crunchy. World <laughs> when you remember the days of when Crunchy World used to be a pirating website, <laughs> uh, you have become the. You remember that. Correct me if I'm mistaken, isn't that what uh, Hulu originally was as well? Uh, no, Hulu was, a, Hulu was always a, a streaming service to- Yeah. Excuse me, to my knowledge. Okay. But, uh, yeah, but Crunchyroll, it, you, it started out as a pirating website. Yep. That yeah, is yeah. actually hilarious, considering what everyone thinks of them now. Oh, hey, the condom ghosts are back. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not kidding, the ghosts look um, like condoms. <laughs> hey, did anyone else ever, uh... Did anyone ever have this with the um, the sniper rifle, where um, you would be able to snipe someone on Twitch Reflex Damn. by freak accident? Yep. Yep. I would get that once in, once in a blue moon. The Halo gods will smile upon you, and you can no-scope on Reflex without having to think about it. My favorite feeling was getting a, uh, oh! getting a clash with the energy swords. Right. And then just and then just going immediately into like oh, the I could just do that the whole time. Like, You're, you didn't win. You didn't win. Fuck. And then I would sit there and wait for them to blow me up with a rocket launcher, but you know. Oh. Fun. Well, actually, one of the most fun things to do in uh, this was a game mode in Halo Four, but it was actually really fun called Ra uh, Rocket Rails, where everyone has a jetpack and everyone has an infinite ammo for the railgun and a rocket launcher. And it it's kind of funny because everyone is just fighting vertically, and that's it. Everyone everyone gets into this one area and everyone is just going vertical. Fuck you! Don't your goddamn makes at me. That's an offer I won't take you up on, Golden. I'm sorry. What? <laughs> <laughs> hey. 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 Okay. <laughs> my, my favorite things 
in any ah, of the Halo shit, games two of them. was it had to be the gravity hammer or just like it's having an enemy lunge at you and just using the shotgun on them because I used to be good yes. with the shotgun. No, I, I was, I was too. No, yeah, no, I, I got that too. You love it when someone has the alien energy sword and they think they're going to get you, but then you tw turn around and you've got the human shotgun and they're just like, oh shit. But they're already mid lunge and they can't stop. It's like that moment from the, uh, the John Tron bladed weapons. Uh, video. What he's got there is a scimitar. It's uh, very, very dangerous to the body. Now you want to make sure that you get your first shot off and kill him. But don't worry, if you miss, you got like seven more. Cox shotgun shoots him. Got him in one shot. <laughs> yeah. Fucking. Uh, you just know, while the we're on idea the of the enemy yeeting themselves at you and you responding with a "not in my house" <laughs> and just. <laughs> Or worse, whenever someone, if, especially if you're on like Blood Gulch, Valhalla, or whatever, you round the corner because you're ready to raid the enemy base, and the fucking tank bear, and the fucking tank, like, turns the cannon <laughs> toward you, and you're just like, oh shit! <laughs> That's, it was in Firing main cannon! Up. Firing main cannon! Hello there! <laughs> 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 He's like, hello there, General Kenobi. <laughs> General Kenobi! <laughs> just, General Kenobi! Just put fucking Grievous' face on the tank cannon. He said, there's no way there, there's no way you're winning that fight. There's no root chalice for that bitch. Oh! Jesus! Looking, the four lightsabers are his kill streak against you with the fucking tank. <laughs> oh! There we go. Oh, you! Fuck off! Right, but, uh... Snowbound could be not Snowbound. Snowbound was a fun map. I it, it was it was overplayed a lot, but I did like it. A uh, high ground. Shit, I loved it. high ground. I remember um, Sand Trap from Halo Three. That was my favorite. Yes. No, I'm I'm giving Halo Three maps. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, one, one of my one best with, like, moments. The big like uh, mobile base that you could drive. Yeah, the elephants. Yep. yep. Something. Something I did back when me and my brother and some of our friends were there. We were riding on mongooses just around the map trying to hit each other with the rocket launchers. Something we like to try to hit each other with rocket launchers. I got the longest range kill on his mongoose with a rocket launcher. And it was just peak satisfaction. It's like, I shoot it, and I watch as the rocket okay, slowly then. travels to the other end of the map as he drives into the fucking thing. <laughs> I could never do that again. I will never replicate that. But it felt beautiful. <laughs> Um, no, no, okay, tell me if this sounds, tell me if this sounds familiar to anyone. Halo 3 or Halo Reach, load of a map, game type zombie, game type is infection, gravity is 50%, zombie speed is 300% movement. Oh, you mean absolute fear? Oh, no. <laughs> that's not I what we called it, but that, that, that's not what we called it, but me and all my friends did that. The zombies always had 300% movement and 50% gravity. Why would you do that, that man? Okay. That was fun. Okay, was I, fun. let me just add, I don't play Halo that much, but I can already imagine how fucking hell or nightmarish it would be. You're moving oh, slow no. while the zombies are after your ass. But the uh -huh. zombies only have a hammer and a sword. They can't hit. They cannot get within range of you. Then they're screwed. And usually, the, one of the survivors, you either have a, a shotgun and a BR. So you could still die very frustratingly. You have to remember the zombies don't have shields. Yeah. Mm. Uh, yeah. Still, like that would be me, just because I have no trust in fucking abilities. My immediate reaction would be spam bullets, spam bullets, and pray to God. Wait, actually, I think I do. I think I do know what you're talking about. Initially, I was thinking I don't think I've ever played that, but I do have oh, no! memories oh, of I thought that was a wall. whoever Fuck. was playing the zombie run at me and having a fucking miniature panic attack because of it. <laughs> because, like, when something runs at you at 300% speed that's uh... with a big fuck you hammer, <laughs> you're gonna panic. <laughs> Oh look, it's Thor! <laughs> I feel like it's Thor. Oh, 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 you know, it's death, and he's forgotten the sight this time. If if there's anything I want to think about regarding the term hammer, it's Hammer of Dawn from Gears One. Oh, uh, I the Hammer of Dawn. Yes, because oh, God damn, I hated the Berserkers in that game. 
The only thing yes. that made me sad. And the best way to kill one is with a giant orbital fuck you satellite. Yeah, because you can't hurt it with anything else. You have to lure it around and hope to god you don't get hit. God, that is obnoxious. No, I did kill her. I did kill her on the first try. 